statistics originally was about trying to communicate really complicated things, but unfortunately the way that a lot of that is communicated, it's incomprehensible to the vast majority of people. And so to the extent that we can render something visually, we have the ability to reach more people. And it also invites a more critical analysis because the data becomes so much more accessible. I'm about to go meet Aaron Hill and his open studio in data visualization at the Parsons School of Design. They're trying to make data more accessible through design, statistics, and computer science. What is data visualization? Well, ultimately, it's just trying to communicate and communicate well. And there are multiple disciplines that feed into that. And the new school has, you know, world-class art and design school. It has a world-class school in the social sciences. And these two broader sets of disciplines work together really well. And you see something very magical when uh, artists and designers and scientists come together and collaborate to create something much greater than either of them could have created alone. In the open studio today, we were looking at an organization's hierarchy and the diversity within that rather large organization. And to look at that graphically makes it much easier to spot anomalies and to spot patterns. What about shapes? Like shape of the entire thing or shapes to represent pieces? I, I think both. Okay. I keep thinking of for the entire thing instead of doing this like linear spreadsheet thing of circle. So it's like the network of the entire organization like instead of a slice. Chunk. So each slice would kind of be a division and we would look at the hierarchies. And we also talked about other ways that we could approach this outside of maybe something that's more hierarchical driven. The open studio is a very collaborative environment. And it's a room that has a lot of different perspectives. Like we're all in this program, it's a very small program, and we're given the opportunity to come to this space and work on projects, or speakers come in and tell us more about the field. I've been using everybody here um, as a sounding board to help me fine tune um, my work and, and, and research questions. Students who come into this program come from very different backgrounds, either the uh, arts and design or quantitative methods or computer science or the social sciences. And instead of getting messy, actually gets really collaborative and allows us to build something much greater than we could have built if we were looking at that just through a single lens.